Ethereum gas fees. If you ask most people in the crypto and Web3 world what their biggest frustration is, this would definitely be the answer. Because when it costs you $100 to send $75, that's not a good combination. And this is a relatively common problem on Ethereum. Okay, so what can you do about it? This is where all the interest in layer two protocols is coming from. Layer two means a way to access layer one protocols, but sometimes faster as well as cheaper. And one of the most common methods layer two protocols use are called ZK rollups. And it's possible that you've never heard of ZK or zero knowledge rollups in the past, but chances are you have used them, at least indirectly. Today, we are going to talk about ZK rollups, what they are, why they matter, and the top ZK rollup projects that we feel stand a chance to truly change the game. First of all, you need to know that ZK stands for, as I mentioned in the intro, zero knowledge proofs. And a zero knowledge proof rollup is a way to batch all kinds of different transactions together. But here's the thing, the zero knowledge proof is a very important part of the process. So most of you, chances are, are investors, not technologists, and that's okay. We aren't technologists either ourselves, but it is important to understand the ZK behind that title, ZK Rollup. So ZK or zero knowledge is like proving, for example, that you know a secret to someone without necessarily revealing to them what the secret is or revealing it to anybody else. This matters because the secret in this case is your crypto transaction, which could be quite valuable and which we do not want to have advertised to the rest of the world, fair enough. So done right, zero knowledge is private and secure. Then we have the roll-up part where these zero knowledge proofs are all batched together into fewer and fewer transactions so we can save on things like gas fees. Every blockchain suffers from the blockchain trilemma. Likely this is something that you've heard of. The trilemma is how to balance the needs for number one, decentralization, number two, security, and number three, scalability. You can focus in and prioritize on one or maybe two of these three variables, but for all kinds of different mathematical and computer science reasons, it's impossible to optimize for all three all at the same time. And the fact of the matter is that every chain sacrifices one in favor of the other two. Ethereum, which is the reason we need these ZK rollups, for example, has the problem of scalability. They suffer from low throughput or a lower number of transactions per second and high gas fees in combination with their throughput problem. It just doesn't work all that well. So not revealing the secret or again, our crypto transaction data, but being able to prove them and batch them together for speed and cost savings does make a lot of sense. There are some major advantages of ZK rollups besides just speed and cost savings when we use this particular method. So it encourages decentralization by validating blocks in a parallel computing model. It increases scalability. It doesn't require a KYC or know your customer process. So we improve two out of the three parts of the blockchain trilemma by using them. However, disadvantages of ZK rollups do exist and they include the fact that they can be time consuming because after all, additional requests for proof from a validator make the transaction more secure, yes, but take up more time instead of just asking for the proof once. And ZK rollups also promote centralization, at least initially, because they require trust when they cannot be proven. So in this case, the trust is that both the validator and prover are acting honestly. Also, quantum computing, although it's not exactly something that is readily available just yet, but one day, theoretically, it could open up ZK rollups to hacks. And a final disadvantage is that ZK rollups are expensive to implement as they're using cryptography to build their own blocks to add to the chain with individual provers. This is akin to adding a sidechain, for example. But all that being said, there are many benefits to the ZK rollup model in terms of helping Ethereum scale. So let's look at the investment opportunities in this particular market with five projects in particular. And we are looking first at the Hermes network, which is an open source ZK rollup that is already EVM compatible. And they've been working with both Polygon and ETH transactions for safe and fast ERC-20 token transfers. So this means that Hermes's transactions can be executed with very low carbon dioxide emissions. What makes Hermes unique is its proof of donation protocol that gives 40% of the winning bid back as a donation to reinvest. 
It has its native token called HEZ HEZ that currently has a market cap, as you can see, of about $125 million with a growth of over 110% in the last 12 months. Nowadays, the cost of each transaction is about 25 cents. That's in Ethereum. And now Hermes is part of Polygon and their merger of two blockchains is really a first for the industry. So the result is that HEZ will delist fully in January and the wind down process for their token started already in December. And when you think about it, it also means that Polygon added this $125 million market cap into its own value, which is now reflected perhaps, arguably at least, in the price of Matic. But we feel that it is. Polygon avoided, for the most part, the recent crypto bloodbath and is up about 60% in the last 30 days. Considering its $11.5 billion market cap, many factors, including this merger, we feel have helped Matic increase or at least retain its value. At number two on our list today, we're looking at Loopring, which is the oldest and probably best known ZK rollup on our list. It has some great features. For example, it's open source, it represents an audited code, and is non-custodial. It's also the first rollup deployed on Ethereum that maintains Ethereum's security standards. And nowadays, the cost of each transaction is about 37 cents. Again, that is in ETH, where the price of Loopring's native token, LRC, is just under a dollar at 98 cents with a market cap of about $1.2 billion. Moving right along, next up and at number three on our list, we're looking at ZK Sync, which also does scale with security. And the features here include the fact that it has no upper limit on how much volume it can move safely in layer two. And so this enables the DeFi ecosystem to grow without limits. Assets can also move more efficiently and quickly between ZK rollups and layer one. And this means that protocols can migrate from L1 to L2 gradually. And the platform has the lowest real transaction cost across all ZK rollups. So currently the cost of each transaction is about 45 cents, again in Ether. And it's a company that does not have a native token yet. However, be on the lookout for that. It's probably the reason why they haven't attracted a whole lot of investment interest just yet, but this could change. The penultimate entry on our list is Arbitrum One. They use rollups and bridges and really lots of tools to help scale Ethereum transactions. Arbitrum has the following features. First of all, developers can start using Arbitrum with no setup required in the testnet. Secondly, it has running nodes that are available. And number three, L1 and L2 interoperability, which is an important feature. Moreover, Arbitrum has a huge ecosystem where you can find wallets, dApps, tools, and all kinds of bridges as well. Right now, the cost of each transaction sits at about $2.90 in Ether. And get this, Arbitrum's ecosystem right now currently has 10 coins listed on CoinGecko with a total market cap of $284 million cumulatively. And finally on our list, we are looking at Optimism, which you may have heard of. It is super fast and super cheap. In fact, any Ethereum dApp can work faster and cheaper using Optimism. Not a bad bullet point to be able to boast right there. They have processed more than 2.2 million transactions from more than 100,000 unique addresses and they've saved more than $100 million in gas fees, which is a lot of money. These guys are a little bit more expensive. Currently, the cost of each transaction sits at $4.14 in Ether. And similarly, the company currently doesn't have a native token yet, but that could change. Expect to see more investment attention once that does happen, once they turn that page. So to sum it up, we've examined five projects here. They all represent options using zero knowledge proofs as a way to scale up the slow and the very clogged and very expensive Ethereum system. Number one, Hermes has the lowest cost per transaction and the token has very high potential in terms of investments. And it's the only project that is low in CO2 emissions. And now it's part of Polygon. Number two is Loopring. It has the second lowest cost per transactions and is the most famous ZK rollup project in the sector currently, which is reflected in the high market cap and its trading volume. We also looked at ZK Sync, which is the most scalable since it has no upper volume limit for throughput on transactions. Next was Arbitrum. And other than Hermes now being part of Polygon, they probably have the biggest existing ecosystem of this group 
Finally, Optimism is the fastest and has saved ETH users by far the most in terms of fees. So if you like this concept behind ZK rollups, i.e. that you're revealing that you know a secret without revealing the data pertaining to that secret and what the secret is, then these platforms are definitely worth a look. We wouldn't be surprised if the two who currently don't have a token come to announce one in the very near future. As a friendly reminder, members of the Altcoin Buzz Army, all of this is just personal opinion and a little dash of enthusiasm, but never financial or investment advice. However, if you do like our opinions, then feel free to like this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, Altcoin Buzz, and hit the bell to receive notifications because that way you get alerted by YouTube every time we publish new content, much of which can be very time sensitive. And if you want even more exclusive and specialized opinions in the form of price predictions, sell signals, deep dive analyses of your favorite projects and altcoins, then you got to check out our exclusive premium group. It is called Altcoin Buzz Access. I always leave a link to this in the description below. That's where you can find more information on our investment strategy for projects like these that have netted us 100x profits or more. Once again, guys, if that is of interest to you, check out the link in the description below. But in the meantime, stay safe, members of the Altcoin Buzz Army. Check out these other videos, which should be popping up right about now. And as always, we do hope to see you again soon in the next video. Take care.